G'day guys, what's cracking? To Aussie here again. So have you heard the news from Domino's? They bought out a pizza called Philly Cheesesteak. OMB, I am super juiced to try this one. And the main reason is, because apparently they have stretchier mozzarella. So we'll see if that is a thing. But also, this thing has a cheddar cheese base. So I am super juiced to try that. And I reckon this is going to be a bit of a winner, this one. I'm going to put that out there just before we get it. I reckon it'll be a decent pizza. So, also we have a mystery beverageino. And I'll circle back to you with more about that once we get the pizza. So, folks, that's what's on the agenda today. The Domino's Philly Cheesesteak Pizza. And I can't lie, I can't wait to try it. I reckon this one will knock me socks off. Let's get it. Alrighty, let's get jiggy with it. We got the goods, babies. Now, you know, I like to share these moments with you and I haven't opened it yet. So let's have a squeeze together. Oh yeah, baby. Looking pretty decent. So let's grab a piece and see what it tastes like. Or well, taste what it tastes like. Not bad. So far, so good. Now, will it be stretchy, tasty uh, mozzarella? Well, there's no stretch going on there, is there? So... I'm really looking forward to that cheese sauce though. Let's give it a red hot crack. It ain't bad. Bit of a change from old tomato base, so tastes pretty good. But what else is on it? We got the cheese steak, mushroom, onion, the sauce, of course, cheesy cheddar sauce, a mozzarella, apparently tastier and a stretchier. But I'm not seeing that so far. I don't know about the tastier, but I think the combination of the two cheeses do pair very well. I am loving that. Actually, I forgot there's capsicum as well. I can taste that now. Green capsicum by the looks of it. I thought it was spring onions, but <laughs> there's no spring onions involved in this one. I can't lie, folks. I am enjoying this. It's a pretty decent pizza. I was about to say I can't see any mushrooms, but there it is there. I thought it was bits of steak, but you got the mushrooms. Now there's a little something I forgot to do. Tell them the price, son. Price, 12 buckaroonies. So 12 bucks. Most of these pizzas these days, when they first bring them out, I guess for probably about the first month, don't quote me on that, but for a while they're 12 bucks, then they go on the regular men menu and become about 19. That lamb one we did a while ago is 19 now, so guys, if you think you like it, grab it while it's still 12 bucks. Don't pay for it when it's 19. That's a bit of a rort for a Domino's pizza, I reckon. But well worth a try for 12 bucks. I can highly recommend it if you like your cheese. If you like it cheesy, not so much greasy, this one. And some of the ones we've have had lately from Domino's, there's been a big patch of grease in the box. But this one, not too greasy, but very cheesy. And that's the way I like it. And I can't lie, folks. I do have a bit of a bloke-sized hunger today. Believe it or not, for dinner last night, <laughs> I had a man shake. Didn't really fill me up, but it held my hunger at bay. So I'm not saying I'm on a diet. I want to just give this old man shake a crack, see how it goes. But we won't be posting that. I'll update you. Maybe at the weigh in in six months time, maybe I will have lost some weight. But please know, a lot of you folks out there are asking, how's the diet going? What about the diet? I never said I was on a diet. I just said, I'm going to, I reckon I can lose some weight. So, 
this thing, like I said, the cheesiness, it is real on this one, and I am totally vibing with it. And to be fair, they haven't scabbed out on the steak. It's looking pretty decent amount there. Pretty tasty. Can't see the stretch factor on this mozzarella, but I'm still loving it. It's a decent pizza. Cooked to perfection on the bottom. So I reckon if you're one of those folks who love your dominoes, I know there's some a lot out there that don't, but if you like your dominoes, that one, well worth a crack for 12 bucks. Get in there while it's 12 bucks. I can highly recommend it. If you like it cheesy too, that is full on cheesy. It's a bit like, I'd say that's the cheese that they put in that volcano thing. And I really did enjoy that stuff. I thought it was totally eats well. And that's why I wanted to give this one a crack. And having said all that, let me say this. I do reckon that capsicum really gives it a good flavour. They've put a good ingredient there, capsicum. I know mushroom and capsicum go on lots of things, but that to me really works. Now with that all being said, of course we've got a bit of a bloke-sized thirst today. And today's beverageino is Monster Ultra Paradise Zero Akakru. Now I have a feeling Akakru means sugar. Somebody Google it and let me know in the comments, but I have a feeling it's some language that means zero sugar. And what sort of makes me think that is the fact that it says zero, and it also says zero sugar there. Don't know what language kokru is, kukru, however you say it. If I'm saying it wrong, my bad. But that's enough jabbering on. Let's open it up, pour it, and give it a red hot swig. I reckon it will be purple. I'm putting myself out there. I reckon it's going to be purple. There you go. If that ain't purple, it ain't far off. Maybe it's got grapes in it. Who knows? Cheddar fair. Oh, no, it lost it. Hmm. Bit of a strange taste, that one. Not sure what I think of that. So I think that was about six bucks. Don't quote me on that. It's one of those American stores, import stores. Somebody once again got it for me. Can't give you much info. Sorry about that, folks. But I can tell you what it tastes like. And if you see it around, it's up to you if you buy it. But I'm not really, it's not really my jam. It's average. I wouldn't say don't get it. Depends on if you think it's too expensive, but... It's got a bit of a strange taste, but it ain't bad. But now to the business end of things, the old Domino's pizza, that's what we're here for. How would I rate it for taste? I'm gonna give it, I like all the bits of steak on it, that's really floating my boat. Steak actually tastes pretty good. For value, I'm gonna give it Three and three quarter stars out of five for value for 12 bucks. And for taste, I'm going to give it four and a quarter. I'm totally enjoying that. It's a bit of a winner. So folks, that's your Domino's Philly cheesesteak. Well worth a crack. Especially for 12 buckaroonies. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And remember, you can never be too Aussie. Huru, and stay fresh. And I ain't going to have any trouble scoffing a lot of this. Not just because I've got a bloke size hunger, but it ain't the biggest peach you've ever seen either, is it? Adios!